Shalom, all praises to the Mosai. Yoho, yoho, shu, this is YYBY. First, I want to show you all my computer, my specs. I got an Intel Core, as you see, 17 i7 9750 CPU, 2.60 gigahertz, 2592 megahertz, six cores, 12 logical processor, um, and the GPU. Um, I think that's it. And I got a, uh, I got a, a good external drive. So this is my specs. It's a gaming laptop. It's a Rock Strits, uh, 64-bit base system. Um, so this is what I have. Okay, 32 gigs of RAMs. Oh, what are RAMs at? Got it in here. 32 gigs of RAMs. Okay. So now that we see that, so what I'm about to do, um, I'm gonna just play anything, right? And. All right, we got that, right? So I'm going to just keep that. So what I'm going to do, we're going to pay attention to the CPU, and I'm going to just copy different things down. I'm going to just copy this and add different instruments. Also, at this moment, my sound card is not my real sound card. You know, it's an ASIO voice meter, virtual ASIO. So it's not a guarantee. It functioned correctly. It's not a guarantee. Um, also... What I'm using at this moment is 192 samples because you can only use 192 samples using this ASIO voice meter because this is how you record, you know, video. Um, so my original sound card is an M audio um, air. Uh, so that's much po more powerful. OK, so we're using this. So it's 192 samples. All right. Um, so normally I have it lower than this, probably like around 64, 92 based on the latency, but for on my computer, the latency still worked pretty good at 192. I think even up to three something in uh in both dolls. All right, so we're gonna stay at 192. Close this. All right, so we'll make a duplicate copy of this. Let's get through this real fast. All right, so what I'll do, let's change it to another instrument. Duplicate this. Um I'll change to any other instrument. All right, so, and we all know that the thing that takes the most CPU on reasons is the combinator. So we can get a combinator, you know, uh, I'm gonna bring this down. I'm sorry, make a copy of that. Go to the combinator. Uh, let's go to grab some brass on that. Okay, all right, make another copy of the combinator. Uh, uh, we know strings and paths normally the stuff that take a lot of the, you know, the information. I'm going to grab a studio sax, you know, because every time in the combinator, you see it's more plugins inside the combinator, as we see. OK, uh, let's go to I'm gonna go to orchestral sound. Let's grab anything. All right. Drop that down. OK. Um, let's go to a pad. I'm going to grab anything. Drop that down. All right. Let's grab another um combinator. Drop that down. Okay. Let's go. We'll come back to that. Let's go to another instrument. Let's go to a this joint right here, Europa. Uh, drop that down. Let's grab another one. Drop that down. Um, let's go get a poly synth. Uh, let's change that to whatever. Drop that down. Let's grab another poly synth. Drop that down. Um, let's go get a synth, a green bass line. Let's drop that down. Okay, instruments. Let's go get a NXT. All right, let's drop that down. That's a grand piano. We'll leave it on grand piano. All right. Um, we'll grab a, a bare alto sax on that John. Drop that down. All right, let's play this back right quick. Man, that killed my ears, man. Let's turn these down. 
So let's get all these. I should have did a double copy. I meant to do that. Let's go right here, grab all these. Turn these down some so it don't scare the hell out y'all. <laughs> my bad, y'all. My bad, my bad, man, my, my bad. Yeah, that messed my ears up. Because really, it's not, we're we not really playing these for you really hear it. You know, so we just want to turn them down very low. We just want to see the visual of the CPU. All right, so let's turn the click off. All right, so right now, we're shooting right here. That's pretty decent, okay? That's pretty decent right here. All right, now, so what we're going to do, let's go back. I'm going to add a few more. I'm going to go, I'm gonna go to the, the Combinator. Because I know at the end of the day, the company, the comp it, it, it's, it got everything in it, man. You know, so we already know what time that is. Uh, you know, so we're going to we gonna go to another pad. Ancient Days, drop that on there. Make sure there's a plug-in in that. Okay, Ancient Days. Okay, let's go to another instrument in the Combinator. We're going to go to Synth Lead. And we're going to drop that John in there. Right? All right, so now, let's play these back. Okay, I'm tripping. Let me go back to the mixer because I didn't make a copy of it, so I got to turn these down. Right? All right. Go back to the sequence and play these back. All right. Now, remember what I was telling y'all. This is not on my audio interface, right? So, you know, the audio interface is more powerful than this voice meter thing, right? But peep this, though. Look where it's at right here, okay? Now, peep this. Now, when you go inside of, let's go to the rack, right? If you go inside the combinators, okay? You got reverse, compressors, same thing in this one. You go inside this combinator, you got echoes, Maelstrom, Stream 4, Alligator, everything digital delay you go to you know not that you go to you got these plugins you got a bass go to this mushroom you got reverse delays equalizer mushroom tractor so each one of these combinators probably got like four or five uh sounds in it so we're just gonna do an estimate right we're gonna do an estimate. So right now I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. I got seventeen VSC instrument sounds, right? And I know some of them don't have uh they are not in the combinator. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna say what? We're gonna do an estimate. What seventeen? Uh let's make sure we get this right. We're going to say 17, even though it's, I know it's more. It's actually more than four or five instruments in each one. Because if you go to if you go to right here, that's what? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we're going to say three in each one of them. So we're going to say 17 times three. So right at this moment, it's an estimate around 51 devices. 51 devices on this sound card, um, this weak sound card, and it's right here, right? And it's, it's like a little popping because, again, it's on the weak sound card, and it's at 192. If I was on my video sound card, you know, it'd do way better than this, so we know that, right? Right, so that's at 192 uh, sample rate, all right? So what we're going to do next, we're going to go inside Studio One. We're going to go inside Studio One. So remember, we got all these tracks. Remember all this. They all playing at the same time. So we're going to compare this to Studio One. 
this is a lot of sounds, man. Instruments, man. A lot, a lot. Okay. Let's go to Studio One. Yeah, now we're in Studio One, right? So let y'all sh show y'all. Sample rate Studio One is at 192 samples. So show y'all that. Um, it's the same sound card, the voice meter thing that we use in the side of the other doll. Because that's what we have to use, not the real sound card. Um, I got this 80 funk bass sound. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to play something. Now let me put a uh let me put this thing on right quick. Just do something simple. Straight to the point. Play that back. Now, I remind you, look what this is at right here already. Just one plug in. This not even, this is just a bass. No effects, nothing on it. This is just a bass. Um, I didn't even use the multi instruments yet. So, let's go to a mod tie. Uh, just grab anything. All right. What I'm going to do, I'm going to drag this down. Okay. It's already a delay on it trying to, you know, see what it's doing loading already. Okay, it's already take the process of loading everything. All right, so what I'm going to do, let me go grab a string. Because, again, remember, we on the weak sound card. Okay, we know it'll work better on the real sound card. So we comparing it on this weak sound card with 192 sample rate. Because normally I record lower than that for latency, but... My computer is pretty good where I can record on higher latency. So really, I, I record on three something or 192 or a little higher than that. And, you know, so, you know, the higher your sample rate is, the more plugins you can add. OK, so. Let's copy this. I'm going to click that. Press Alt. Bring that down. Let it go. It ain't moved yet. Um, Might copy now. OK. Let me go right here. Move it down. There you go. Boom. A little freezing up. Play it back. I'm sorry about that. Let me, let me turn these down right quick. I forgot I make no copy. Need to make a copy, man. So it's freezing up. All right. So let me duplicate this. So it could be on the same value. So I'm bust your eardrums no more. My bad. <laughs> All right. So let me let me copy that. All right. So what I'm gonna do when I copy that, I'm gonna just drag a, a uh, I'm gonna get a bell and just drop it on that one and come, you know, load it. All right. So I, I haven't even used uh the multi instruments yet. These just solo instruments by themselves. See, when I click on them, they're not even going. It's, it's moving slow. It's freezing up. Big time. All right, so let's play these back. Now the play is kind of freezing up a little bit. Got to, you know, it's hicking up, hiccups. Taking a moment. Look at that. Yeah, so, yeah, so, um, I got four inches, but I noticed that when this is not selected, it's down low. When you select this, and it take a minute, this, I already pressed it, you know, let me light up, uh, let's play these back, okay, this is where it's shooting with these, already, okay, let's, I mean, I shouldn't even have to add no more. 
Again, I haven't even added no VST, no, no multi instrument. Let's go to a multi instrument. You know, matter of fact, because I already know what's going to happen if I add the multi instrument. Let's, let's go to these. I just clicked them. They're taking a long time to select. Okay, remove these. Let's go to Big Band just by itself. Take a minute to load. It's like this even on my regular sound card, man. It's freezing up. I'm trying to move it. 